Welcome back. I, I forgot what I was supposed to say. Welcome back. This is the Amy Jack. We got Desolation Suicidal Gunslinger. Let's go, go, go. That's what I'm supposed to say. Something like that, right? <laughs> oh, boy. It's hot, man. I've gone out and I've done my grocery shopping for today. I cooked. I cleaned. And now I'm sitting here recording. It's 3 o'clock. It is prime heat time. I wish I could uh, I wish I could hold it off till tomorrow, but I just I can't. I really I really got to get better about getting up in the morning when I need to record and just just doing it right like just get up at 6 a.m. record the videos it's nice and reasonably anyway cool at that point and uh, you'll be good but instead what I do is I wait until it's the hottest point of the day and then make sure that I have to suffer through it as much as I possibly can. Which is not what you want to do, right? It's not what you want to do. It's not quite the right way to, to handle things. So it's really my fault that I'm so hot because uh, I just I can't I can't make the right decision. I can't for the life of me. I can't get up early and, and record. I don't know. I did I did get up early, but I had to go shopping. You know, I mean I got up at like ten. It's not really early, but it was definitely cool enough to record at ten. It was actually a relatively cool morning, and there's a little bit of a breeze right now, so it's honestly like. I mean, it's pretty bad, but it's not as bad as it has been, you know? Like, it's, it's a, one of the better days that I've been recording, so, you know, I can't complain too much, but it is still, it's, it's still very, very, very warm, for sure. It's very, very warm. I had uh, the first video of the Yamcheck Tribes went up. I made the thumbnail, and it's kind of funny. I made the, I made the thumbnail, like, green-themed because, uh... I don't know, I feel like I should be close to my microphone. I made the thumbnail like green themed because uh, I have the blue theme for RuneScape, I have the pink theme for KF2, and I was like, I don't know, the other like... To me, the most contrasting color is green. Um, tech, like a lot of people consider green and blue to be the same thing with like Gru or whatever, but... Or like a lot of... Uh, Throughout history, I suppose we'll say. Not necessarily a lot of people, but throughout history, uh, green and blue have been, like, often just considered the same color. Because they are so similar, apparently. They're, but uh, to me, they are extremely high contrast. Maybe I'm colorblind. Maybe I see green the wrong way. But uh, I don't think I do, because I do see how they're similar. But they are uh, very high contrast to me. Okay. Not going to hit that one. So I, I picked... Anyway, I picked the green one, because uh, it was the highest contrast between the other three that I had. I was thinking I might go for like an orange, but I didn't really find an orange color that I liked, so I decided against that. Um, I was thinking I might go for orange, but yeah, I, could, I couldn't find one that I liked, so I went with green. And then I was uh, I was looking at my subscription feed, and uh, Northern Lion's Northern Lion Try is also green, and I'm like, oh boy. I just like straight up accidentally completely ripped it off. <laughs> Like, name, thumbnail style, or color anyway, the, the color theme of it. And like, oops. Complete accident, genuinely, but uh, definitely some. Oh my god. Definitely something that happened. Can't deny that. Can we get that shot? Not quite, hey? That's okay. You don't have to get every shot. You know, you land 100% of the shots you don't take. I read that on uh, on a wine bottle once, I think. Of course, I've seen it elsewhere, but uh, the one that stands out to me the most is definitely the wine bottle. All right, we got seven dudes. We're dead. Why are there so many us? Why are there so many? Oh my god! What the heck? <laughs> It should be illegal for there to be this many husks. That, that's all I'm saying. Oh my god. You guys gonna like attack each other? Thank you. Thank you for killing each other. That's all I can say. Too many dang husks. What the heck? He's got like a huge pack of them. Oh, I'm sweating though. And the thing you gotta uh, you gotta realize is uh, I don't I don't sound like it, but uh, I am a girl. 
and uh, sweat is just super uncomfortable for us for reasons that uh, that we don't need to discuss any further than that. It's very uncomfortable though. I will I'll tell you. Yeah, you got long hair, so it gets like on the back of your neck, and it's all gross. And uh, I wish I didn't skip because I hate being down here. Um, it's got really long hair, so I have like up in a ponytail right now. But even then, it's still just like I don't know. I should put it up in a bun, but honestly, I don't know how to do that. <laughs> I've never put my hair up in a bun, so I don't really know uh, what I'm doing when it comes to putting it up in a bun. You know, I don't know how to do it. I've never done it. I don't know I, sh I should learn because it, uh, it seems like a very, very useful thing to be able to do. Because uh, definitely keep your hair off of you as much as uh, it possibly could. Oh, I couldn't see the stupid crawler. So uh, a bun would be nice, but I don't know how to do it. So that's like probably the one of the worst things. You know what? Uh, what happens quite often is uh, when I don't have like a uh, a hair tie or something to put my hair up, which is not often, because there's hair ties everywhere in this house. We have three girls in this house. There are hair ties everywhere. Doesn't matter where you are, you'll find a hair tie on the floor somewhere. <laughs> Worst case scenario, you got you got a tie. Don't worry about it. But uh, like you know, let's say I, I somehow something happens. I don't have a hair tie, right? What happens is I'll sit down and I'll just like pick up my 18 pounds of hair and like drape it over the back of the chair just to keep it off the back of my neck, just to keep it a little bit more breathable, you know? Cause man, hair gets so hot. It's so so hot because it's uh, it's a very good insulator is what I've learned since I've started growing my hair quite large large long it's uh, it's a good insulator and then it like picks up your sweat too so it does it makes you sweat more and then it holds it there just to make it as gross as it can possibly be like there's nothing worse than sweating with long hair it's Horrible. But that's what I do. That's what I do, because I just, I can't bring myself to wake up earlier to record, so I just, I have to suffer. Uh, poor me, pity me. Can you, like, send these things? Can you send them? I want to send it. I want to send it. Please allow me to send... I don't think you can send it. I don't think you can send it. How great would it be if you could send it? Just full send. We sick. They don't let you do it. I'm sure it'd be like very difficult to actually implement that. I'm not saying I forgive them. I'm just saying that that's their excuse. I'm not saying it's a good enough excuse. Just gotta make sure that that's clear. It's uh, it's unforgivable to, to not make them full sense. You know, just just to think about how glorious it would be to have uh, like target practice there. There's maps that have like target practice where they're farther away, um, but they're not good because it, it you, you gotta it's gotta be sendable. You have to be able to send it out and then pull it back and replace it and. See what you did? I need that. I need that experience, that that gun range experience, that full thing, you know? And uh, it's not what any KF2 map that I have seen ever gives you. It's just, uh, you know, fun included separately, you know? It's okay, I forgive them. It's still a pretty good map. And it's still, it's still a fun game, you know? Like, we're not, we're not... I'm not suffering here. Game ways, game ways. Anyway, you know, literally I am. But like, from from the game perspective, it's a it's a very fun experience. I'm uh, I'm having a having a very good time. I I look forward to uh, to being, you know, being able to have a good time and also cool. But you know, hey, you can't you can't have the best of both worlds, right? You can't can't play KF2. I could, but I don't really play it off camera anymore. So, can't uh, can't play KF2 and also, 
You know, the KF2 thing has actually been such a, a huge help to me personally in my life because, uh... Whatchamacallit? Whatchamacallit? The, uh, like, the, the being able to commit myself to things and then, like, force myself to do it, even if I don't necessarily feel like it. Um, and then still enjoy it anyway. It's been, uh... It's been a very... Where are you guys? Has been a, a very good thing for, for just my personal development as a, as a human being. and um, So I definitely, I definitely appreciate it. What, what did we say about husks? Huh? You're dead. You're dead. Don't even. Did it take enough shots? Yeah, too many. Too many shots, but you know what? It's not about the number of shots you took, but the amount of time it took you, you know? If you if you take one shot, but it takes you a minute to make that shot. All I'm saying is it took me less time to kill it. Now, who's taking a, a whole minute to make a shot? Probably not me right now when there's a King Flesh Pound right next to me, but... Somebody who's really bad. See you, bud. You used to be able to, like, get yeeted off that, too. Which was, uh... Apparently something that uh, people quite enjoyed, but I never I never experienced because I have not played the original Desolation. Maybe we'll do that. But it's too dark for me, I think. I think it'll be I think it'll be too dark for me. I'm, I'm a fan of the uh, the lighter, brighter maps. I think that the uh, the changes to Desolation were... We're largely for the better because they they got rid of a lot of the um, the eerie, creepy feel of this map, which is what the creator was going for. So I think that it's rather disrespectful that they did it, but I do feel that they were improvements. You know, I feel it made it better, but uh, it's it's against the the creative um, what should we call it? The creative. Uh, Whims of the uh, the creator, so it was uh, it was a rather disrespectful move, but fun map nonetheless. I like it. Very very fun. Can we get to the end screen so I can be done. <laughs> All right, look at that, perfect timing. And uh, that's gonna do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it, subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say, and I will see you next time. Bye bye.